Coming up on today's Panther Beat. Our girls' bowling team is on a roll. Spanish classes enjoy a unique assignment. And Mad Riggles tickets are on sale. Your Panther Beat starts now. Hello, I'm Jay Bands. And I'm Robert. This is your Panther Beat for Tuesday, November 28th. How was your Thanksgiving? It was good. I got to eat a whole bunch of food. What's your favorite Thanksgiving food, O'Fallon? Tessa finds out. What's poppin' Panthers? I took on the hallways to ask people what their favorite Thanksgiving food was. Favorite Thanksgiving food is stuffing because my grandma makes it good. <laughs> favorite Thanksgiving food is mashed potatoes, homemade, because I like the little pieces of potato. And I just love it because potatoes are the best. Uh, my favorite Thanksgiving food is turkey. It's because my aunt makes it and it's really good. The superior Thanksgiving food is green bean casserole. They'll crunch little onions on top. You can make it with just whatever's in your canned goods. Top tier. Who wants to host the biggest show of the year? Auditions to be in February Frolics MC. MC auditions are Tuesday, December 12th. Pick up an application outside Mr. Pendable Room 607. MC positions are open to all seniors. Anyone from the class of 2024 is encouraged to apply. Interact Club is collecting school supplies for OTHS classrooms in honor of Maddie Best. Maddie wanted to become a teacher and shared a love of learning. Let's talk up our classroom so all students have the supplies they need. Drop off tissues, pencils, notebooks, and Clorox wipes to any classroom or Miss Neely at Milburn in room 1506. Hear ye, hear ye. It's time to get your tickets for the annual Mandrigal's performance. Enjoy a Yuletide dinner and show featuring our OTHS choir. Here's Alex with more information. Hear ye, hear ye. The OTHS Madrigals performers are hosting their 46th annual show. Madrigals is a Renaissance-themed show with eye-catching costumes and royal vocal performances. Eat dinner and desserts at the Royal Dinners on December 1st and 2nd at 7 p.m. and enjoy light snacks and dessert at the Beggars Feasts on December 2nd and 3rd at 1 p.m. Get your tickets now at OTHSchoir.com slash madrigals. And for a limited time only, students can use code PANTHERS for $2 off of tickets for the Saturday Beggars Feast. Reporting for Panther Beat, this is Alex Hatton. Students get $2 off this Saturday's Beggars Feast. Visit OTHSchoir.com and use code PANTHERS at checkout. Now let's pass it over to the sports desk. Hello, Fallon. I'm Snoopy with your Panther Sports. Congratulations to our boys' basketball team. Our Panthers traveled to Jacksonville and went 3-0 in the Crimson Classic. Rooney Harris and Jane Rush were named the first team all-tournament. In bowling news, our Lady Panthers opened their season with a third-place finish out of 15 teams in the Triad Invitational. Our Panthers were led by junior Amber Montemonte, who finished third out of 90 competitors with a 204 average. She was joined by top 30 finishers sophomore Athena Martin and senior Delaney Hall. In today's sporting events, hockey plays Alton at the Rexplex at 7.30. Boys basketball plays at Granite City. Good luck, Panthers. Now over to the birthdays. What's up, O'Fallon? I'm Brady with the birthdays. Birthdays yesterday, November 27th, were Jaden Harris, Yuretsi Ogden, Chayam Parham, Josiah Ross, Eldrick Spells, Caleb Turbefill, and Isabel Volner. Birthdays for today, November 28th, are Franklin Bieri, Rowan Bruner, Jim Matai Chepkoit, Chloe Davis, Jose DeLeon, Savannah Galloway, Natalie Johnson, Jackson Randolph, Ian Rockman, Tyler Tipton, Journey Thompkins, Dawson Whedon, and Marissa Welch. That's all from me. Now back to the news desk. And now for your club news. Speaking of food, I heard that AP Spanish classes have been turning up the heat in the kitchen. And Bella sees what they have been cooking. <laughs> The AP Spanish students right now are working on their culinary chapter and we figured the most likely 
way that they would use their Spanish in the future is probably ordering food, having to um, determine recipes and ingredients if they visited a Spanish-speaking country or met somebody from a Spanish-speaking country. So in Spanish class, we're working on uh, cooking Spanish food. So I'm cooking tortilla de patatas uh, and pimientos de pico. I'm having a great time. Uh, it's fun cooking with another person. I mean, I don't really know how to cook, but uh, it was fun learning how to cook. We have lots of different countries represented um, for the foods because we actually have students at OTHS who have backgrounds in different countries like Honduras, Guatemala, um, students here from Spain, we have students who are Puerto Rican, we have students who are Mexican, so those are some of the countries. Some of the things they were including in the video were words of the ingredients and then the different cooking utensils, um, the words for stove, refrigerator, to chop, things like that. You have to like take the pan and take a plate and then flip it and that was terrifying, but it was also super fun. But also the cultural and historical significance of the food that they're serving. For example, if it would be served every day, is it for breakfast, is it a, for a holiday? So if you can imagine yourself making a video, a tutorial of some sort, but doing that in a second language. So then they're bringing in the food that they've made so we can try dishes from all over the Spanish-speaking countries. The Gay Straight Club Alliance meets today from 3 to 3.30. Report to room 805. Everyone is welcome. Interact Club meets this Thursday in the Smiley IMC. First Priority meets today after school in room 1024. Tomorrow, after school, Student Council and the girls' tennis team are hosting a rock painting event in honor of Maddie Best. Everyone is invited to come to the Smiley Cafeteria from 3 to 4. That's it for today, O'Fallon. For up-to-date news, videos, and more, head over to our Panther Beat YouTube channel.